Okay, before I hang these fenders back on this car, I am attempting to do a body alignment here, and this is the result of my third day of body alignment. Well, not three full days. I've found that generally after about four hours, I get so irritated with it, I just wanna beat the glass out of the wagon. And believe it or not, this is a hundred times better than it was in the factory. You can see right here, well, maybe you can't, but right there is where this right here hit this just all the time. So that's how nice that one was. And you can see here, that panel just goes from about right to holy moly. And here's the thing, down here at the bottom, you can, and I have, line this up where all of those gaps are uniform, symmetrical, across the board, looks great. When I do that, these gaps are terrible. And then when I make these gaps really nice, all of these are terrible. So after the second attempt, I actually got a cardboard box, flattened it out, drew out, traced the outline right here of that window and found out two things. Number one, the hole this is supposed to fit in is not the same as the frame on the window. Here's the next thing. The right one and the left one are not the same. These two, same thing. The frame will not fit the hole that it's made that's made for it. It's just really irritating. So I've today, this is the uh, three and a half hours at this point, I've been working on happy medium. Well, not happy medium, just medium. I'm not happy with it, but this right here is about as good as it's gonna get. You can see here, that line is not particularly terrible. That one's kind of okay if wide, but you come over here and you see not so much. You can see right there, not so much. I'm not even gonna show you the bottom there. And on the other side, I've got kind of the same thing. You can see how tight that is and how wide that is. Look at how wide that is. And you can see they're not straight either. But this line here is straight from front to back. The door is shut. Everything is probably as good as it's going to get. And uh, I am going to come out here again tomorrow and take one last look at it because I may be just at the frustrated and irritated stage. But I'm afraid this might be as good as this is going to get. Look how nice that line is. And then look at this. Whoop. It has truly been, it's just really frustrating, but just to let you guys working on G-bodies, wagons, four-doors, and I know not anybody's going to really be working on a four-door, but if you're working on a wagon, this is a problem you're going to come up against. These frames do not fit the openings that are made for them, and you're just going to simply have trouble with that. You could cut them out, but here's the thing. If you measure from here down, not on this, not on the chrome here, but down where the window is, up to here, on either side, you're going to get different numbers, which of course leads to different angles, which leads to, it ain't going to fit. Get as close as you can, tighten it all up, carry on. Me, I'm just hoping that, well, because all of this, Everything in here, between the drip rail and the top of the doors, all of that is going to be flat black when I'm done with it, and I'm hoping that hides a lot of that. It's just the best I can do is, the best I can do is hope for the best. That's it.